result, buyers and sellers in a springtime standoff, with realtors left waiting. Greg Rasmussen, CBC News, Vancouver. That decline in Vancouver's housing prices appears to be part of a global trend hitting wealthy owners in some of the world's most expensive neighborhoods. The Economist surveyed various cities around the world. They looked at the top 10% of each city by value, or what The Economist calls the prime market. So London's toniest homes have fallen by 20% from their peak in 2014. In the past year, Hong Kong's top homes fell by 9% in Manhattan, 4.3% in Vancouver, a whopping 12%. <laughs> Take this for example, when Michael Bublé sold his West Vancouver home in February, he was asking nearly $7 million. It sold for over $5 million, and yes, that's more than he paid for it in 2007. But in that financial stratosphere, it's not that much more. Up next.